Yo, Yo dudes. dudes! Welcome to Sweet Peanut Chili and Coconut Curry. Or noodles. Yeah, whichever you call them. Uh, it's delicious anyway. We're gonna cook it in five minutes just to show you how quick, simple, and easy it is. Three, two, one, one. Go. go! Okay, so this is a flavor sensation. I've got pan on a high heat. I'm gonna add in 100 grams of peanuts, raw peanuts. We have a, a pot of boiling water. I have four nests of noodles, that's 200 grams. Put them in whole if you want long noodles. If you have children and you prefer smaller noodles, just crunch them up like that. Yeah, so we are aware that there's two of us first and foremost, because you go, oh, five minutes, but there's two of you, there's only one of me. Bear with us. Yeah, it might uh, take you a little longer. Yeah, it might take you 10 minutes, but it's still gonna be really quick. Over to this side of the pan, I have three cloves of garlic. I'm just chopping them finely. Oh, nice chopping skills. So yeah, these noodles literally take four minutes to cook, so I've got them up on a high heat. And, and try to use whole wheat, they'll just be higher in fiber. Most people don't get enough fiber. I have a thumb-sized piece of ginger. Just, we're using organics, so there's no need to peel it. Just again, chop it as finely as you can within the limited time period. Beauty. So I, I think the main thing about cooking dinners quick is that the longest, the bit that takes the longest is chopping the veg. So I guess it's all dependent on how quick you can use a knife. Yeah. Wield a knife. We're we ready to go. Okay. Oh, hang on, hang on. But I'm putting off my peanut. Oh, oh I'm nearly stabbed me. <laughs> Jesus, was lucky. Okay, pan is still on high heat. We're putting in two tablespoons of oil. In well, the top of our oil goes in our chopped ginger and garlic. Uh, scallions and chili next. Oh, chili, oh lovely. Okay, so we're, we want this spicy, so we're putting the seeds of the chili. If you don't like it spicy, leave it out. Okay, we've got three minutes 30 left just to give you an outside oh, check. Oh, this is exciting. Okay, in go. And in case you're wondering, we've done about 30 of these five minute dinners, so do check them out if you like this style. Style of quick. Uh, and we genuinely like your kind of feedback on what you, if we're gonna do more of these five minute dinners, what you think we should do, any suggestions, we're, you know, these videos are for you, so please talk with us. Yeah, share like your, that. share your thoughts. Okay, chop the scallions as fine as you can. This is all about quick cooking. Okay, cool. Jeez, wow, it is a high heat. Great. Well, it's great to be summer here again. Look, we're both in the vest. It's brilliant. Well, nearly summer, isn't it? Yeah. Early summer. Okay, scallions in. Next step, broccoli. I have about 200 grams of broccoli. Chop the stalk up. We're going to put that in separate. Break up the florets. Just pop them in there. Wow, gum. super gross. Yep. Okay, we have about two minutes 40 left, Mr. Okay, Flynn. Right. So, sauce-wise, okay, so you might wonder, oh, this is just a whole lot of veg. It looks boring. What are we doing for sauce, Okay, Steve? sauce, right. We boil the kettle. Boil the kettle. I have peanut butter. So I've gone for a smooth peanut butter. I'm taking three tablespoons. One, two, three, in it goes. In on top, I have three tablespoons of tamari, measured to perfection, as you can see. I have liquid sweetener. I'm using maple syrup. I'm gonna go in with a tablespoon. In that goes. Take, take your fork, make sure it's resting on the side. Take your boiling water, and we're just gonna pour in a little. This is just gonna help the breakdown and create an easier emulsion between the water, the liquid, and the tamari and the peanut butter. Just give it a good stir. We want this to come together. This is quite, a cool, this is quite an adventurous five minute dinner. There's many of these done. This is where we're pushing the boundaries here. Here we go. What's it's exciting. Gonna... Okay, so uh, while I, I didn't tell you what I was doing, I just chopped a courgette, AKA zucchini, depending on what part of the world you live in. Just continue to keep stirring your sauce until it starts to come together. You'll see it starting to come together in a little bit of a paste. That's good. How are we doing time-wise? Uh, probably two minutes. We're one minute twenty-eight. Jeez. Okay, okay, right. okay let's Showtime. get a party right, started. Let's get I'm going in with a red pepper as well, just because. Okay, get ready to drain those noodles. Oh my god, this is. We're it's up really against it today. It's so it's exciting. Oh my goodness. Okay, I've got a handful of bean sprouts. I'm just popping them in the pan just to heat them up. Good. They're going to add just a crunchiness of freshness and a vitality. And the thing about fast cooking veg is that if they're kind of al dente or kind of half cooked, that's fine too. Obviously at home you can give them another couple of minutes, but uh, we just want to show. We like the Jeopardy. Okay, in goes coriander stalk, or cilantro stalk as it's known. Noodles have been in for four minutes, as is the broccoli, just whip them out. I'd say give it another 30 seconds there now, this is good. That's good, three, two, one. I'm okay. give it a drain. My brother won't listen to me. No. Oh this my goodness. Broccoli 35 seconds. In the pan. Wow. This is Take tough. our sauce. In goes our sauce. It's in a coconut milk. Last oh my god. Oh, here. Gives a weapon. Gives a weapon. Tool. I need a tool. 
That's exciting. How are you doing time wise? 20 seconds and counting. Din, din, din. 16, 15, 14. Jeez, okay. Whew, this really was. We get a half cup dinner. Woohoo! Okay, in goes one tablespoon of sesame oil. Last ingredient. And final oh, top it. Sesame oil in late. Which Jeez, it has actually hit its temperature. Ooh. It has hit temperature. Timer done. Stop! Contestants! Okay, I'm done. Wait, hang on, hang on, one sec, one sec. Final and a thing of peanuts. So Look if you it. wanted to make that a little bit easier, obviously you use dry roasted or already kind of cooked. Dinner uh, done. Okay, I'm going to taste it. Wow, look at that. We really did make quite the mess. I mean, that's really good. Five minutes, okay. Well, let's see. Okay, as we said, the purpose of this was just to show how easy and quick cooking can be. And how big a mess you can make in five minutes yeah. as well. Okay, let me get a fork. This one was a little more adventurous than usual. Okay, here we go. Sweet uh, peanut, sweet ginger. peanut, ginger, and coconut noodles. Mm. The greens. Wow, that's really nice. Yeah. Mm. Really good complex flavors. That's good. Mm. I'd be very pleased if I got that in a restaurant. Mm. Way better than a takeaway. Mm. Very tasty. Uh, really good. Highly recommend it. Probably going to take you 10 to 15 minutes at home, but really very tasty. tasty. Genuinely Cook. very tasty. And obviously, I love the bang of peanut. It's really good. I like the peanuts on top as well. And obviously, use whatever veg you have. Just make sure they're fast cooking veg. So like peppers, courgettes, mushrooms, spinach, spinach beans. all those kind of type of things. Um, thanks a lot for watching, dudes. We have a new cookbook out. It's now number one in Ireland and number eight in the UK. So it's an international bestseller. So thanks to anyone who's Thanks to anyone who's It's 100% vegan. Uh, it's really good. We have a whole section on happiness as well and what makes us happy. Um, so yeah, thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing and tally-ho!